Hello, this is Erica from BlackAndHeadFilms.com, and today is day six of the Write It series for Black History Month. Today is February 6, 2017, and on November 6, 1901, American musical theater and film actress Juanita Hall was born. After developing her voice while singing in the local Catholic church choir, she went on to attend Juilliard School of Music in in New York City. In 1950, she became the first African-American to win a Tony Award for Best Supporting Actress for her role as Bloody Mary in South Pacific. Along with her role as Bloody Mary in South Pacific, she is most known for her role as Auntie Lang in the film Flower Drum Song. In addition to her movie career, she also enjoyed a long and distinguished career as a concert artist and nightclub singer. If I were to do a project about Juanita Hall, I would class, cast Sonia Song. I think they have very similar features. Um, their eyes are the same. They have similar foreheads, chin areas, cheeks. I think that she would be a perfect Juanita Hall. Now, a story about Juanita Hall could go in many different directions because of how dynamic and how talented she is. You could carry, um, you could have a film about her movie career. You could have a film about her choir career. career. And she worked with a lot of choirs. She was the director of the Works Progress Administration Choir from 1935 to 1944, or the Westchester Choral and Dramatic Association from 1941 to 1942. And she had her own choir, the Juanita Hall Choir, in 1942. So there are, she did a lot of choir work. So you could do a, a film about that part of her career. You could also do a film about her personal life. Something that I found interesting was that she got married as a teenager to an actor named Clement Hall. Um, and he died in 1920 when she was 19 years old. So I wonder how she ended up being married to him what their relationship was like. Um, It's very interesting to me. Why did she feel the need to get married? Also, I know that her mother died when she was just an infant and she had to go and live with her grandmother and that's how she found her love for music while she was living with her grandmother. So you could approach her life from the the point of view of the losses that she had and, and how that might have influenced her talent as a wonderfully talented blues singer. Um, the loss of her mother, the loss of her husband, or something like that. I think it would be very interesting, especially because she does not have the typical look that you would expect of a glamorous, vintage Hollywood 1940s actress. I think she's beautiful, but she doesn't have the look that most people think of when they think 1940s glamour, vintage Hollywood. So I think a film about Juanita Hall would be really interesting. Um... If you think it'd be interesting, leave some suggestions for how you would approach it down below and make sure you go out and write it.